Mushrooming is a newfound passion. I was introduced to it by my partner, Kristen. She took me foraging and we got some chanterelles recently and some black trumpets and I was immediately hooked. So now I'm spending a little time going out whenever possible. It's September in New Hampshire and there are so many different variety of mushrooms out there. I don't even know what they're named. All I know is that I did find a bunch of Amanita muscaria, which are the Alice in Wonderland mushrooms, if you will, that will kill you if you just eat them normally, but if you boil them and prepare them right, supposedly they have psychotropic effects. I'm not going to try it. I'm not a professional, but let me just show you a little bit of my mushrooming and enjoy. Ladies and gentlemen, chanterelle mushrooms at their finest. Take the bottom off, in they go. Right here is a great example of an Indian cucumber. I don't know if there's a more politically correct name for these. I don't know the scientific name, but these are lovely little white, oh, carrot-like fruits, if you will, or, or vegetables on the bottom that taste very, very sweet. Um, here's another one here that is actually has a couple of berries on the top. And here, let's, let's look at this one over here, and I'll actually dig this one up and see if we can't get... This one's nice and lit, and this one just flowered and had berries. Some, something ate the berries. But what I do is I kind of dig down a little bit instead of pulling straight up. And then out comes the Indian cucumber, right? I mean, it's going to be filled with dirt, but you get a hundred of those and you got yourself a meal with some of the chanterelles. A hundred, that might be a little extreme, but... Mm, very sweet. So this mushroom right here is called a destroying angel and you can see it has a little skirt on the bottom and my friend Jess who's the person who taught me all about mushrooms and I have many many more questions for her said that if you eat that mushroom you would die by morning and it would be really painful death with lung failure and all kinds of things so these are scattered about the trail amongst all of the other mushrooms that we're seeing. So avoid the destroying angel. She's very pretty, but she's very dangerous. 